which you once spoke. Is now not the time for Minato to celebrate again? When Great Kimono would pass, the town would come together to honor the beast and release its spirit. Would they not? Mm. Indeed, Hime-sama. An excellent idea, I'm sure. Allow me to discuss the matter with the elders. I believe they may favor the suggestion. Especially since the revival of the Karakuri has stimulated such an interest in the ways of old. Good. I have made a very fine proposal, I think. And should it come to pass, I wish you much fun and excitement. <sighs> Arigato. That will be all. Cool. We will make all the necessary arrangements for the festivities. I am sure you ought to rest. Can't even open up my map. Seeing if there's any uh any quest. Mm. Ah, you're enjoying the festivities, I hope. Records suggest the last time this festival of returns occurred was more than 100 years ago. But at that time, the supply of celestial thread from the Spirit Isle was already faltering. So it must be even longer since the festival has taken place properly. I intend to, shortly. I was just doing some research on the Kuninarashi. It seems that Earthbreaker had been dormant for a good 10 years in the region north of here. It must have covered quite some ground. Passing the sacred mountain and continuing southeast along the Blossom Trail, perhaps in search of celestial thread. I can only presume the arduous journey took its toll, resulting in those fissures the Kocho were swarming over, and finally, the great beast succumbed to human hunters. I suppose it failed to find a suitable feeding ground. Either that, or celestial thread levels all over Azumar are waning. There was a terrible war here, in this region, about 15 years ago. Great forests burned, and there was a mass territorial expansion as many kimono sought new habitats, which is what drove humans out. If the changing flow of celestial thread is going to result in renewed kimono unrest across the entire region, then... Well, I'll continue my research, and you continue to exercise caution when you're out hunting. Yes, ma'am. Natsume was looking for you. Way up there. Holy shit. I guess I can get up there through the elevator. Maybe. Festival. Is that no one's interest? Uh, over here. Oh, she let her hair down. <clears throat> First time seeing her hair down. Some people were a little wary of you before, but everyone will have to accept you now. Trust me, most of us in Minato welcome people from elsewhere with an open mind. After all, most of the town's residents were outsiders once upon a time. In ancient times, there were lots of hunters living across Azuma, and they all helped each other out. Then later, when the samurai rulers gained power, this area became a province overseen by a Shugo governor. The samurai slowly pushed hunters further east until they were left with nowhere to go but Minato, here on the eastern edge of the region. 
Generations of hunters have lived here, mixing with others who fled to Minato to escape difficult lives under the samurai. And now you've arrived, with your amazing ability to conjure and control Karakuri. Perhaps you're the person Minato has been waiting for, come to rescue us from our plight. <laughs> it's funny, really. You just came here looking for stronger prey, but... You've already saved us twice. I can't thank you enough. Anyway, have you been enjoying the festival? The Rite of Returns will be starting soon at the altar. <laughs> you've still got time to enjoy the party. Let me know when you've had your fill. Is there anything we can actually do? Like mini games or stuff. So I'll talk to the people with icons. It's a great party. Oh, look who it is! The hero of the day. Enjoying the festival? Yeah? That's what I like to hear. I was on my last legs even before we started preparing for this, but hearing you say that makes it all worthwhile. Oh, I better be running along. The other elders will be fuming if I'm not back soon. They'll give me a real eyeball. See you later. Who are you? A big party with the whole town. Enjoy. How's going, Chief? The sack is sweet That's tonight. Wasted. There hasn't been a festival like this far too long. So I intend to make the most of it. <laughs> This is delightful, and we all know who we have to thank for it. It stung a little to donate my entire stock of gunpowder. <laughs> but festival sales are soothing the pain. And Minato is to enjoy your stimulating company for the foreseeable future, yes? <laughs> a profitable outcome for us all. <laughs> What a heartwarming day. Lady, you had so much gunpowder. Makes me wonder what you're really doing. Oh, I am delighted the festival is going ahead. It is most gratifying to see you enjoying yourself. Even if my contribution was merely to request the arrangements. Conversing with me hardly constitutes enjoyment. Please, mingle among friends. So there's one more person to talk to. Oh, drink a little too much sake, dude. You're the hero. This festival gives me pangs off. I'm not sure what. It stirs distant memories, perhaps. I feel more comfortable watching at a distance. But you should embrace the mood. I'm sure the whole town wants to celebrate with you tonight. Okay. I think I've talked to most major people. Oh. <laughs> what? Actually enjoying himself? I, I was just laughing because I I mean I'm only here because Natsume told me to come. I've never been to a big festival like this before. It's actually not bad. Anyway, why don't you go and creep up on someone else now? Creep up on yourself, kid. It's good to let yourself go. <laughs> oh, you're back already? Do you want to head over together for the ceremony? Sure thing, ma'am. I'm glad you've enjoyed yourself. Come on then, this way. Hi, <laughs> 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 
Fire liberates the soul. The beast's spirit will return to the heavens and rest until it's reborn in a new body. It's one of Minato's oldest rites. It's a load of old hokum. Forget the next life. There's enough to worry about in this one. Isn't that right, Chief? For our town, Minato will prosper like you once did. Even more, perhaps. Forgive me for intruding. Are you awake? Wait, there is a matter of some talking? urgency I must discuss with you. Oh, you're talking to me. Allow me once again to express my heartfelt gratitude for your exploits. Your courage saved Minato from devastation. But I confess, my blood ran cold yesternight at the sight of the kemono flying overhead. I had not known the citizens of Minato call that kemono Amaterasu, the bird of Ospis. I wish that its appearance truly were auspicious, but I fear that Minato is rarely so fortunate. Our near misadventure with the Earthbreaker has again made me wonder what more I can do for the town. I had already been consulting with trusted kin on the matter. They suggested bolstering town defenses since there is a very real prospect of further attacks. Consequently, I have summoned carpenters of the renowned Tsuruhashi clan from the capital. They are skilled at building large structures and well versed in the use of karakuri. I share your excitement. It will bring great strength to our town. There is, however, one matter that troubles me. Ordinarily, one would travel here from the capital across the sea. But I am told the Southern Ocean is too perilous at present. Hmm. The clan must therefore arrive by land, a journey due to take them through the Akikure Canyon. The land there was laid to waste by war, and as Kemono increased in number, the canyon was sealed shut. I have arranged for it to be reopened so the carpenters may pass. But as a precaution, I would ask that you meet them there and provide escort. Uh, so a new area, <clears throat> but we have to secure straight passage. Good, then I know they will arrive safely. Now, if you will excuse me, I have further preparations to make. some optional stuff let's pick up these quests actually ah 
You're here. Perfect timing. I've just put the finishing touches on a new prototype I was hoping you could try out for me. Oh. Actually, it's a weapon you already know. The hand cannon I put together for you to fight the giant bear. But I let you down then because it broke in battle. It's such a vital weapon, too. I feel like I failed as a blacksmith. So I've been improving it and refining it to be more reliable. I've just completed the work. And I've taken the opportunity to get another new weapon ready as well. Oh. I really think I've done good work this time. If you don't mind, I'd love to hear your thoughts. Hmm. So two new weapons. They say the canyon is teeming with mighty camel nowadays. Make sure you're properly equipped, alright? Stronger and sharper. That's oh, three looking, actually. So there's the hand cannon. There's the claw blade and a Kuda Kitty staff. I'm gonna have to test these out. I'm pretty much familiar with the hand cannon, but just forge that one, equipped it. I just wanna see the move set. Metal. Let's go to the training area. Mess around with the new weapon. Base player. That doesn't matter. Ah, oh, this is kind of like the dual blade. Whoa, what the fuck? I kind of like this weapon. <laughs> Alright. It's almost like a kunai with chain, but it's like a it's a dagger and anything. Dagger and claw. So that's a cool weapon. I might I might get around to enjoying that. There's a lot there's a lot of good movement to it. Or just have to get used to it. And I also have to upgrade it. Just tell me what you need, and I'll give it all my attention. Let's forge the edge. Let's forge the staff and see how the movement is on it. <laughs> right, we got the staff now. Oh yeah, let's do attack tutorial tutorials. Mutate what? The weapon mutates? It's almost kinda like dual blade, but it doesn't have as good of movement. Well stowed. Hmm. Oh, so it has like three modes. Hmm. 
Whoa, what the f Okay. So it literally turns into a giant sword. Alright, that's a pretty versatile weapon too. I might I might kinda dick around with the other weapon. Let's see if I can upgrade it though. Like the kunai with chain kind of scenario going on. If it's weapon care you're looking for, then look no further. Forging, repairs, whatever you need. Hmm. Stronger and sharper. That's what you're looking for. Screw the cannon too. Why not? So we have all th all the weapons. Forged. One, two, three, four. That's not all of them, though. Why, why have I not forged? Maul. Bow. Have I miscounted? Oh, I, oh, I miscounted. Okay, yeah, I, I do have all of them forged. So what path? Oh, let's go to that path. Hmm. I would have to figure out like what element would I want more. I fire. Then I would have to hunt that one again. So, I guess my secondary weapon can be the claw, Edgestone Claw for now. My primary weapon could be that. But eventually I need to figure out where to find. Oh! I've been finding. Either I've been finding Mirror Stone or we got Mirror Stone from killing that creature. Hmm. Ooh, I think that's about it. You can't afford to neglect the equipment that affords you protection, can you? Hmm. So yeah. Okay. Can I be of service in any other way at all? Oh, she has a request. Oh yes. There's something I was hoping you might do for me. Could you collect some lava back materials? I've got so many good ideas, but not enough materials to make them. My head's spinning. <laughs> Arigato! I'll make you something in return. Yoshichisa asked me to make some karakuri driven farm equipment for the Guild of Farmers. It's not like making weapons, but it's still fun and challenging in its own way. And I think I can use some of these ideas for weaponry later. Oh, sorry to interrupt. Just wondering how you were getting on with fixing those harpoons? Uh, don't worry, I, I haven't forgotten. I'll come to pick them up at the dock later if you could get them all together. Domo, that'd be great. Now, let me guess. You were just going on and on about Karakuri? Don't you ever get tired of them? Tired of Karakuri? Oh, I've never really thought about it. I just want Minato to flourish like he used to. And Karakuri are the key to that. And now that we have this amazing hunter in town, I feel sure that we're closer to my goal than ever before. <laughs> you haven't changed a bit since you were a little shrimp. Yes. So, about those materials, you should find lava backs on the spirit isle. That I, I do I know. I rely on you to handle something like this. Oh, looks like you need this uh, fixed. Ah, good. <clears throat> Just the person I was hoping to see. Yes, there's a kimono I like you to hunt. Hmm. 
It should yield some materials that young Yataro will find very useful. He wasn't born here in Minato, you know? Poor child, lost his home and his family's war. He was left all alone. But somehow, he found his way to us. I tell you, he's got a natural gift for making things that way. Better than any of us. Anyway, what were we talking about? Oh, yes, yes, of course. Yataro was grumbling that he didn't have the materials he needed. So, Hunter, you go and hunt the kimono. And when the job is done, just have a little whisper in my ear. If the boy found out, he'd tell me I was sticking my nose in where it wasn't wanted. Okay. Two-parter, it looks like. Or multi-part. How many chapters there are in the game? Was it? I'm not in the business. this person <laughs> are they way up there it seems like <laughs> hey, where's this person, man? Didn't know you can actually go down here. Makes sense, though. Your timing couldn't be better. The Southern Ocean is as rough as hell these days. You want to know what's still to do? Here's the list. Hmm. Let's see. That. That. All right then. Yo, another day, another hunt. Sounds good. I'm about to get out myself. Oh no, you're not going anywhere. This is a shore day, and you know it. Oh, Jingoro-san. I, I do know it, but if we don't start making decent catches. People are gonna struggle for food. Few rumbling bellies won't hurt, but that sees can we eat Kamara? Fierce. You're not seriously going out. I have to. I'm not making light of the conditions, but we need the fish. I'd have failed your old man if I were to let something happen to you. Just wait until it calms a little, lad. It's the seas been as rough as anything recently. Some say it's Kemono's doing. We haven't had a good catch in ages. Kemono affecting the sea. We're not out on the water. How's anyone going to eat? And if the seas don't settle, then what? How will any of us get by? <sighs> We're never going to agree on this. Not that I don't understand where he is coming from. The way I see it, if no one's prepared to take a risk, then the situation's never going to improve. <laughs> anyway, don't worry. If I see a kimono, I'll just run away like I always do. And if worse comes to worse, at least I'll be able to lure it away from everyone else. That's what I'm worried about, you stubborn cod. I don't suppose you could help? Maybe go along and see what's what? From what I hear, you are a very fine hunter. 
If this young hothead gets himself attacked by a kimono, you could see it off, hmm? If that's what it takes to keep you happy, Jingoro-san, then it suits me. It would be reassuring if you came along. I was gonna take a boat over to the spirit isle today. I expect you've got some errands to run. So let's meet up again over that way later. Okie dokie. Sorry to add to your workload. I really gotta find out. It's gotta be... It's probably gotta be very high up then. Really high up. I have to take the elevator. up this one. If I might ask, I have a request that calls for someone of your skill. The town requires some materials from a kemono that can be found on the spirit isle. They're to be delivered directly to Suzuran Sensei. I can offer a meager reward, I'm afraid. But I would be very grateful for your help. We greatly appreciate your offer of assistance. No other deliberations? <clears throat> so I wonder what they use this platform for other than the festival, because this looks significantly like a big area. Quest for you. Do you know the traditional hunting songs of our town? Nope. They sing of Minato's brave hunters stretching back through history. My parents taught them to me before they passed away. And it will be my duty to pass them on to the next generation. Unfortunately, though, Minato has been steadily losing its hunting heritage. I've never even seen a real hunt with my own eyes. How can I you want to witness one? Without truly knowing what hunting is, what it really means to hunt. Doubts like that plagued my every hour. But now you're here. This is the chance of a thousand years. Recount your hunting stories to me. Tell me the magnificent tales that are carved into your heart. I know your first-hand accounts of great hunting exploits will bring life to the lines of the song. First, tell me of the great bear. Tell me how the Earthbreaker's mighty roar shook you to your core. Okay. too far south but it is okay Tomkazura that's the samurai right how are you holding up Togaki may ask no, it's not. something for then Oh, uh, it might be. Nah. I'm trying to remember who that was. Is it the kid? Is it the other kid? Let's go over there. So we got some optional stuff. Ah, good hunter. Nope. Let's go here.
the last war in these nope. do make me sad sometimes. <laughs> Learn to make some new stuff if you care. Tomica Zero, where the fuck is this person? I don't remember who that really is. So, does that mean we're still in chapter one? Hmm. So chapter two is about to kick off, or maybe chapter three? Very interesting. <clears throat> yeah, I'm starting to really feel it now, as like, I should probably do a save, and then end the stream.